lovely people. Hello, how are you doing? Hi, Lord of mercy. Let me start again. What's up, YouTube? What's up? How are you all doing? Hope all is well. I'm your lady, Ambitious Jackie, and I'm here to give you another video. Guys, just a bit of health issue update that I'm experiencing I want to talk to you about. But before I do so, I am asking you please to thumbs up my video, comment, turn the post notification bell on that when I drop a video, you will be notified. Okay, guys, and a big, big, massive thank you to all my viewers and subscribers. Words not enough to say how much I thank you guys and I do appreciate you all. And for those who just joined in the Ambitious Jackie family, welcome to you all and I hope you find your stay welcoming, okay? So guys, just a few minutes of update to let you know about my health issue as I said before. Anyway guys, since I did my surgery this 17th of May, I was quite fine, 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 no problem, no complication, nothing. Until Saturday, I make some soup, which makes um, soup that consists of chicken foot and beef. No beef bone, no salt beef, nothing, just plain fresh beef, just a one pound of plain fresh beef and a pound of chicken foot. Exactly, I will use, I'm, gonna, I'm telling you. Anyway guys, I use it to make this soup. When I make the soup, I was going to work, I have duty Saturday evening after I make the soup. So I think I didn't feel hungry at all. So what I did, I bring my soup with me as usual, like when I'm going to night duty, I bring my, my, my supper, you know? So bring the soup with me. So after I went to work and I settled down, changed my uniform, settled down, do the necessary things that I'm supposed to do and settled then after guys then i went and i started having my dinner so while i were eating guys not even halfway in my food um i remember i ate a piece of yellow yam guys for me when i'm eating my food i don't chop and swallow for me i chew my food properly especially ever since i have this stomach problem so guys, I sat there and I was contently, contently eating my food. Then I felt like something. When I chew and then I swallow, I felt something in my stomach, like so, making me feel like I want to stifle. You know when you're choking and I stretch up and I think, what's this happening? Anyway, the feelings were there, they need to wear it off. I can't continue eating. So after I finished eating, I drank some Relsa. Relsa is the thing that is a um, liquid thing that that I that helps me to digest my food every time after I eat something. I'm supposed to drink some of it. So I drank some and along with some water. Guys, I came a much 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 better until in the night like not even night like 2 30 it's then on sunday morning i felt my stomach guys bad feelings bad feelings weakness in my stomach take over me guys from 2 30 until daylight i was sitting up on a desk just sitting up looking like this sniffing alcohol to help the bad feelings and all that. So anyway, when they clear up now then, about after five, I went outside and the person that was supervising the shift, I told her that I am not feeling well and told her what happened to me and she may um, break a piece of mint, not peppermint, a type of other type of mint. I can't, I can't, Remember the name of that meat. Anyway, she gave it to me. Then I washed it and boiled it and drink it, guys. And then I feel a bit better. 
But then, guys, coming on to go home, I could hardly walk because the stomach was feeling so weak and bad. And you know that your stomach is what controls the hold of your body. Once the stomach is not strong, your feet is going to lose way as well. And I took my time and I walked to the bus. And uh, when I was coming home, then I called my husband and I said to him, can you pick me up quickly, please? I am not feeling well. And, you know, he picked me up at the bus stop after the bus dropped me off. And then he did so. Guys, when I came home, I was weak as a rat. Weak, 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 guys. All I can do is that my husband helped me to get undressed in my living room and say, go and lie down. I could, guys, knowing me, when I come home from work, no matter whether it's night shift or day shift, the first place I eat is my bathroom. But yesterday, I couldn't. I have to, guys, I went straight to lie down in the, not this room, the other spare room. Guys, and while I was there, lying down a few minutes after feel my stomach feeling away then I rush I noticed that I want to vomit and I went rush to the bathroom guys when I rush to the bathroom everything comes up whatever supposed to come up you know what I mean after I wash my mouth and then I went back to lie down guys when I went back to lie down fall asleep wake up again with these bad feelings and this stomach problem again, feel bad again, feel this time that the vomit's coming, then I rush back to the bathroom, guys, the second time that I went to the bathroom, what came out, came out of me, it was green like the grass outside, when my husband not, uh, realized that I was there vomiting again, he came and he looked and he said to me, are you vomiting again? And all I could say, let me please not. And he told, held me while I was um, bringing it up. He held me across and helped me. You know, um, moral support. I don't know if that's it is. Yeah, he support me. And I bring out that. Then after I wash my mouth, then I went to back to lie down. Then eventually that time my stomach clears. Not feel anything. So there and then now I asked him, can you get me a jelly? And he went out and bring a jelly. When he came back, I only have like two mouthful. And that was it. Guys, I suffered. So, nothing to eat from Saturday evening when I ate that soup. Yesterday, nothing all day on, apart from the two mouthful of jelly water. And this morning now when I woke up, my husband insisted that I try and eat something. But... The appetite is not there. So what I did, I made a cup of tea. At first I took my omipazole, that's a half an hour pill that I took before meal. So I took that pill half an hour. I took that pill and then half an hour later I took drink a cup of tea. Guys, and when I was drinking the tea, I have to force myself to finish that cup of tea. Guys, I don't know what's happening. Until then, guys, until now, no food, nothing. This is my food. This is my food. Ensure and get a This is my food. Guys, this ensure that they used to do other things on social media is what helped my strength or my weakness whenever I am like this lack of appetite or when my stomach is on me. So guys, all I am just thinking, let me just bring you up to date on what's happening and you just continue to pray for me while I pray for myself. Because guys, if is Satan working, I am telling him, like what I'm telling you, I'm sending it out there in the air that he is working in vain. Because he will not get me. No. He will not get me. Because it's not the first I am eating beef. I don't eat beef like the beef with stew beef or that. But if I'm making soup, as I said before, I always put beef in it. 
guys and what my stomach gave to me from Saturday night up until even this morning this morning I wasn't having any stomach problem but the weakness you know like you vomit and you're not eating then that's what happened your body becomes weak so guys I am not letting anything get out to me all I'm trying to do is eat healthy stay positive because positive mind will get you get get you through whatever comes your way but negative mind will keep you down so i am not thinking negative i'm just staying positive trying to stay positive so guys this is all i have just to say to you to let you know what's been happening because you know you are my family i will not keep things away from you i always keep you posted let you know what's happening so okay guys so i am going to love you guys and leave you and tomorrow tuesday god spare life and all being well i have to say all being well and if god spare life i should be back at work day shift tomorrow so by god's mercy i will be at work tomorrow morning okay guys so thanks for watching my videos another time guys and as i always say guys if you can't be good sorry please be careful guys because there were a lot there so it's not easy all sort of yes so my people i'm gonna love you and leave you Bye for now. Thanks for watching. And as I said before, you can't be good. Just be careful. Bye. Love you all.